In this video, I'll show you how to connect your Printful account to Shopify, add products, and set up shipping. But before we dive in, you'll need to create accounts on both Printful and Shopify. So let's start there. First, create your Printful and Shopify accounts. To connect Printful to Shopify, you'll need to have accounts on both platforms. If you're new to Printful, go to our website and create a free account by clicking Sign Up. You can make it extra quick by using Google, Apple, or Facebook. For this tutorial, I'll sign up with my email and fill in my details here. Once your account is set up, you'll land on the Printful dashboard. To connect your Shopify store later, you'll go to the store section. But before we do that, let's make sure you have a Shopify account too. To create one, go to Shopify's website, click start for free and follow the steps. Shopify offers a free trial, so you can use that to set up your store and connect it to Printful without any upfront cost. Second, connect Printful to Shopify. Log in to your Shopify admin and head to the app section by clicking add. If you see the Printful app right away, go ahead and click add. But if not, just type Printful into the search bar. Once you're on the Printful app page, click install and then confirm by clicking install again. You'll be asked to log into your Printful account. Go ahead and do that. Then authorize access. And that's it. Your Shopify store is now connected to your Printful account. To make sure your store runs smoothly, there are a couple of quick setup steps we need to take before moving on. If you plan to sell internationally, you'll need to enable international markets in Shopify. From your Shopify admin, go to Markets. Here, you can activate Shopify's default international market, which includes 27 countries, or you can create custom submarkets by clicking Create Market and adding the countries you want to sell in. For example, if you're based in the US, you might want to sell in European countries. Or if you're in the UK, you could target North America and other parts of Europe. If you skip this step, customers in certain countries won't be able to check out from your store, so don't forget to set it up. Add Printful products to Shopify. Head to your Printful dashboard and open the My Product section. Think of this as your product command center. It's where you can create, edit, and manage all your designs. To start, click Create Product. This will open the Printful product catalog where you can choose from hundreds of items to add to your store. For this example, I'll pick a t-shirt. I'll go to Women's Clothing, T-shirts, and select the unisex staple t-shirt from Bella Canvas. Then click Start Designing. Now the Printful Design Maker will open. This is where you can customize your product. Start by selecting the product color, sizes, printing technique, and design placement. For this tutorial, I'll choose all available sizes, the aqua t-shirt color, and the direct-to-garment or DTG printing method. I'll only customize the front print placement for this example. Next, you can add your design. Most people upload their own artwork by clicking Upload, but you can also create something directly in the Design Maker. Use the text tool, clip art, quick designs, or premium images. There's a wide variety of assets to fit different styles and niches. If you'd like to try designing inside Printful, take a moment to explore these tools. For this tutorial, I'll use one of our quick designs. Once your design is ready, you have two options. You can save it as a product template by clicking Save Template, or you can publish it directly to your Shopify store by clicking Publish. For this example, I'll click Publish. On this page, choose your mockups. Mockups are digital images that show what your design looks like on a real product, no photo shoot required. Start by picking your mockup style, then select the mockups you want to use in your Shopify product listing. Look for the star icon that marks your main mockup, which will appear as the primary product photo in your store or listing. Click Continue to head to the pricing section. This is where you set your product price and profit. The Printful price is what you pay for fulfilling each order. If you check Include Shipping Costs and Calculation, you'll be offering free shipping to your customers, meaning you'll cover the shipping costs yourself. Under Price and Earnings, you can set your markup percentage. This percentage is added to the Printful price to determine the retail price, which is what your customer pays. You can also adjust the calculation by focusing on either your earnings or your retail price, depending on what matters most for your business. At the bottom, you'll see the final breakdown, the retail price and your estimated earnings, which is your profit per order. 
And if you'd like, you can get more detailed by setting prices for each size variant. Just switch on the buy variant toggle. Click continue again to go to the details section. Here you can set your product title, language, and description. You can keep Printful's default description or rewrite it to better match your brand's tone. Scroll down to the product visibility section and make sure the publish product box is checked. This ensures your product goes live in your Shopify store once you hit publish. When you're happy with everything, click publish. Your product will be uploaded to Shopify and will also appear in the publish section of my products in your Printful dashboard. And just like that, your product is live in your store and ready to sell. Here's a quick tip. From the drop-down menu next to your published product, you can duplicate it to templates. This saves the product in your Printful account under product templates, so you can easily reuse it for another store or marketplace later. In that same drop-down menu, you'll also find options like edit prices, edit description, and download mockups if you'd like PNG or JPEG versions of your product images. Over in your Shopify admin, you can also go to the product section, select your new t-shirt and make adjustments. For example, you can assign a product type to make it easier for customers to find in your store. If you already have products in your Shopify store that aren't synced with Printful, but you'd like Printful to fulfill them, you can import them. To do this, go to your Printful dashboard, click stores, then select view products for your Shopify store. Click the Import Not Sync Products from Shopify toggle, then click Import. Those products will appear in the Imported tab. From there, click Sync Product and choose the closest match from the Printful catalog. For example, I imported a mug and a skateboard. Since Printful doesn't fulfill skateboards on demand, I'll leave that one as is. But I can sync my mug listing to a Printful product so Printful can handle fulfillment going forward. Setting up shipping. Printful automatically sets up shipping profiles for your products in Shopify. This means that when you publish a new product, the shipping rates are added for you and you don't need to set them up manually. In Shopify, a shipping profile is basically a set of rules that determines how shipping rates are calculated for certain products and where they ship from. To see your shipping profiles, go to your Shopify admin, click Settings, then Shipping and Delivery. Under App Shipping Profiles, you'll see the profiles that were created when you push products from Printful to your store. I recommend leaving these as they are. Any changes you make will reset back to the default settings. Most of the time, you won't need to change shipping settings because Printful handles them for all Printful products automatically. But if you're also selling non-Printful products in your store and need special rules like different shipping rates for certain products or regions, you can create a custom profile in Shopify. Just click Create a Custom Profile, set your rules, and assign them to those products. To check shipping costs in advance, head over to Printful's shipping page. I've linked it in the description. There you'll find a full breakdown of rates for each product category, estimated delivery times, and the price of shipping additional items. Another way to handle shipping is by enabling live shipping rates. Those are real-time, carrier-calculated rates that adjust based on factors like the order's size, weight, destination, and the time of purchase. This way, your customers always see the accurate shipping costs at checkout, so it's a smart way to offer transparent pricing without having to set fixed rates yourself. Keep in mind, live shipping rates are only available for Shopify Advanced or Shopify Plus plan users. To enable live shipping rates, go to your Printful dashboard, More, Settings, Store Settings, and Shipping. Under Shipping Configuration, check the box for Enable Printful's live shipping rates for your storefront, then click Save. If you sell products that you store at Printful's warehouses or fulfill elsewhere, you'll need to set shipping costs for those separately in Shopify. Don't worry, Printful's live rates won't interfere with your manual rates for non-Printful products. When a customer's shopping cart includes both Printful and non-Printful products, Shopify automatically takes the lowest available shipping rate from each group and combines them into a single option at checkout. This way, your customer sees just one shipping price instead of multiple ones, which can lead to confusion. Set up Printful billing. The last step is to ensure that your billing information on Printful is set up correctly. To do this, go to your Printful dashboard, click Billing, Billing Methods, and add your billing information and primary payment method. 
Here's how billing works. When a customer places an order in your store, they pay you directly. After that, Printful charges you directly for the fulfillment and shipping of those products. This happens through the Printful wallet. Think of the Printful wallet as your digital wallet that makes payments quick and reliable. You can add funds with a credit card, PayPal, Apple Pay, or even Klarna. Once money is in your wallet, it's automatically used to cover each order, no manual payments or approvals needed. You can also enable automatic top-ups. Instead of adding money yourself, your chosen payment method will automatically add funds to your wallet whenever an order comes in. This way, payments stay seamless and worry-free. We've created a billing breakdown video that walks you through the process step-by-step. Step. Click the card or find the link in the description below. One last note, the Printful website is updated periodically to give you the best experience, so a few things might look a little different when you watch this, but the overall setup process will stay the same. And that's it for this tutorial. Your Shopify store is now all set up with Printful and ready to go. If you need more guidance, visit the Printful Help Center. There you'll find detailed articles that will walk you through every step of setting up your store. And if you'd like to keep learning about selling online, check out the other tutorials on our channel. I've linked one right here to help you keep building your brand. And in the meantime, happy selling.